What's up, guys? J.R. Raymond back again at the Training Center in TurboTech in Chesterfield, Michigan. I know we touched on it already before about the arm swing, but I've seen and had an awful lot of players and an awful lot of questions about how to fix their swing and how to get it to be a little bit straighter. So we're going to talk about that when we return. So one of the biggest habits that people have is allowing their swing to get out of line with their head way too easily. And a lot of it comes from where their push away goes. So when they're standing in their approach and they start to move, most people that have an issue with this, they wrap the ball behind their butt. So when they get moving, that ball goes to the right and it comes behind them just like this. So now where do they have to go? Now they have to come back this way and shut it down and their hand gets to the outside part of the ball. How easy is it to play the inside part of the ball? I know you guys heard me talking about playing in the inside part of the ball a lot. So how easy is it to get your hand back to the inside part of the ball when you have to collapse your shoulder this way because the ball's behind you? It's dang near impossible. Almost, I would say, probably is impossible because now we're going this way. Now as the swing comes down, you have to tuck it in and your body just isn't really meant to do that. So how do we fix that? How do I get the ball to stop wrapping behind my butt like that? All we're gonna do is instead of pushing the ball to the right, we need to over-exaggerate this a little bit. So as I go, instead of going here and pushing it this way to allow the ball to wrap behind my body, all I wanna do now is I wanna focus on pushing it here. We're gonna go in front. So from this view, we're gonna go here, and let it push this way. So it's gonna feel like you're going way outside with it and then back in, but you're really not going to. When you feel like you're going here and out, you're actually going to be here and straight instead of behind your body. So the next time you go practice, and maybe you have the opposite problem. Maybe you do do this and the ball gets way out here and then you collapse down and you can't do anything because the ball's outside your body. If you have the opposite problem, you need to really focus on trying to swing it to the right so that way it can straighten back out and stay behind you. So you have to get yourself on video. Go check out my uh, lessons and technique video at the top of the screen. You can see that video up there that shows how to set up a camera. Set the camera up on 20 board for yourself so that way you can go and check out where your swing goes. The, the camera has to be lined up properly so that way you can see directly behind you on where your swing goes exactly. So. Um, when you're trying to play up the lane, that's a good thing. When you're trying to play left, your swing may vary just a little bit. So keep that in mind when you're doing this. But when you go practice, make sure you check out where your swing's going. Because if it's out of alignment and gets away from your head, it's going to be really hard to repeat those shots. And it's going to be really hard to uh, score high like you would like to if you don't know where the ball's going based on where your swing's going. So just a quick tip there. I wanted to touch on it again. I hope it helps. Uh, let me know what you think. If you have any other issues, I'll try to help as much as I can. And we will see you guys next time for the video. But make sure to go subscribe if you haven't already. And go over to Turbo 201 Grips page and subscribe over there as well. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks.